Hi everyone, the Lone Wolf here. Welcome back for some more EVE Online and it is time let's accept the Damsel in Distress level 4 and we are actually going to try and run this one in the Golem, a gift from Zack. Amazing gift of course. Golem with a rather expensive fit I think and an implant set as well giving me some potential DPS that's off the charts compared to the uh, Raven Navy issue. So let's see what we have to do. Um, ba -ba -ba I'm gonna have to take this down and I can just straight up warp to the location all right and then for the fittings what we have is we've got of course cruise missile launchers uh, tractor units and a salvager the bastion module typical for the uh, marauders of course uh, macro drive macro jump drive X-Type extra large shield booster some capacitor missile guidance computers uh, a resistance, four Kaldari Navy ballistic control systems, uh, capacitor control circuit, large warheads. All right, and then in the drones, I actually put in some uh, augmented op goblins and augmented warriors. So let's go and let's see if we can uh, if we can do this. Activating uh, those mid slots, and I'm actually going to try right away to um, jump away using the micro jump unit i've never i think i did that on on the test server like once or twice but that's really it because these guys do get pretty close so off we go and ah beautiful we're a hundred kilometers away from trouble so let's get started and let's see how a pleasure hub sentinel likes to take a beating but let's also go into uh, so the first volley is off without being in uh, Bastion mode that already took away half the ship <laughs> in comes the oh a man that attack rate is pretty fast as well So let's launch the first one and actually stop the um, The launching for just a moment just to see what the impact is probably won't be enough, but oh my god That is some pretty pretty good damage number two Blap he is down Let's see what this does on one of these cruisers and then back there we've got Cruel as well. And like this I've got a range of 219 kilometers. So apparently a battleship is two volleys. Is that right? So that's volley number two. Let's press stop on this one. And then let's go off to the next one. These cruisers are one shots. Oh my god. It's that is. <laughs> that is nuts. Next up we've got Pleasure Hub Guardian. Let's fire. Pleasure up Guardian, let's fire one volley at those guys as well. Yeah, just straight up one shots. Let's see how we do against these uh, these small little cruise henchmen. Ooh, that one survived actually. So let's launch another volley at that one. They are one shot as well. Oh my god, this is uh, more than powerful. That is crazy. Cruel's henchman, blop. Let's see if that one hits well as well. <laughs> yes, it does. And then we've got Cruel in the back who then calls in for some reinforcements. Uh, let's see if he needs two volleys. I sent two volleys. Nope, that's another one shot. That is crazy. All right, Pleasure Hub Sentinel, open fire. One and uh, I think my second... Jesus, this is so fast. This is so uh, much more comfortable than... Um, then in the Raven Navy issue, of course, the price tag is a lot higher, but two shotting these battleships, that's kind of crazy. And so I can really try to manage that. One volley, second volley, next target. One, come on, I click two, one volley, second volley, click stop. <laughs> this is just crazy, 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 crazy. One volley. Second volley, it's away we go. And then for the final one, one volley, blop. This is nuts. This is nuts. Zach, you are uh, crazy to give me a gift like that. This is absolutely mind blowingly amazing. Uh, then we are going to do a quick reload, I think, and get ready to attack the pleasure hubs because that also spawns in more reinforcements. So I'm going to take. Uh, pleasure gardens they're actually called we're gonna take the first one I'm actually going to send a single volley at that one let's see what happens with that 
should hit. Half the shield's gone. Next one. Uh, this, this can probably take a little bit more of a beating. You need the damsel in your cargo holds. Let's see what happens. That rate of fire. That bastion mode. That DPS. That's just nuts. So this is probably going to be like the wrong one. What's the range on? Now I have to start thinking about completely different things here. 125 kilometer effective range. So this should be something that I should have uh, dropped right off the bat. And just to finish off this um, pleasure garden, let's let's do that here while we enjoy that goddamn golem that's just launching these missiles from 100 kilometers away, doing massive, massive amounts of damage. That is nuts. All right, reload all. And this time, this pleasure garden, I do think, will uh, trigger some extra stuff. So let's get a full reload again as everything explodes in the background. And let's start with the first volley, see if there's a response on the shields. Because this is also, of course, a little bit of learning those missions again. Number two. Off they go, super speed, it's in, it's actually now in armor and it's not doing anything, okay, strange, let's get away from the sound effect, that's a little bit annoying, I'll probably be a bit more zoomed out generally speaking, and then we get this into structure, there it is, there it is, oh, including a spider drone, all right, uh, kind of curious, oh, and more stuff because I kept launching volleys, all right, let's try to manage this, first volley, these are still just sentinels, so that should be... Do Ooh, man, it's, it's, it's a lot, and it's Azor is here as well. well. Let's see if we can keep two-shotting. Oh, I accidentally re-clicked, so that one is down. Uh, let's get the web drone as well. Two of them on this one. So I think that you can slow this down. One. Next one. One volley on that one. Let's see if... Uh, ah, that's half the ship. Interesting. Next. Open fire. Oh, and I'm actually taking a little bit of damage here for the first time. So I do have some augmented hobgoblins for these drones. So let's do that. Or can't I do that? Now in... Um, launch drones. Yeah, I can. Okay. For a second there I thought that that would not be possible. Okay, and that's a big, big rep. Let's press F on you. Make sure that the next guardian is gone. Two volleys on the sentinel, please. That's one. That's two. Oh, God damn it! I probably did three again. Fire. One. Fire two. And I will just keep doing twos, I think. And in the end, Zor is, taking, is uh, staying very far away. Uh, oh, and one of them did not get two shots. Interesting. And we're just gonna wrap a little bit. Send another missile. Let's see if we can if we can uh, one shot these um, death dealers. That one's gone. Yep. All right. Good stuff. Target the rest. A little bit of wrapping. One volley at the Pleasure Hub Guardian, and they're like 60 kilometers out. We still have another web drone that's on us. Let's send in the drones. Super fast reload, so this is quite comfortable. And fire again. Let's see here. Pleasure Hub Guardian. Blap. He's gone. Good. Now we've got seven assassin. Uh, different ship. Let's see if that's a two shot. One and two. In the meantime, my drones are actually going after one of those frigates. So I'm actually going to allow them to do that. Go like that. Quick rep. And then next frigates. Oh my god, this is so strong. <laughs> this is crazy. This is so good. Blop on the next one. Let's see if it is two, and then Zor is half a million. Let's see what kind of uh, damage he needs to take. Yeah, so these assassins definitely need several volleys. I think we're two on Zor on this. 
100 kilometers away, so they do have that, that travel time. But oh my god, he's, he's, he's gonna be tree shot. <laughs> that is really nuts. Open fire, and there we go. Zor is down. This, yeah, the, the damsel doesn't get teleported. But I think that you do uh, get her in like... Um, is something... Oh yeah, and I just remembered that as well. When this pleasure hub explodes, it actually does an AoE blast that can cost you your drones as well. But uh, there she blows in the background and the damsel is going to be inside that cargo container. And that is uh, a pretty, you know, for, for someone that's basically still learning uh, these level 4 missions, this felt crazy completely completely crazy uh how quickly and how much damage this uh, this golem is putting out so again thank you so much for this gift zack it is absolutely uh, amazing and yeah this is gonna speed up my progress in level four missions uh, quite quickly um i'm going to yeah for that loot i'll probably need uh, like a transport ship because that's going to be a decent amount so we are going to pick up the damsel in style approach drones are in microbe drive active and i'm gonna save the location for this one if i can right oh i wanted to do save location and then i accidentally so that's my bad let's stop the ship for just a moment oh yeah she's pretty fast as well look at that pretty damn fast and nimble so let's drop this again and this time I right click and press save location, submit, let's open this one up, go like that and then I should be able to uh, get back for the loot in a different ship after all of this. So we'll have to try and manage uh, exactly how we best use this, uh, oh, let's stop this, this and this as well for all the sounds, uh, how we best use this golem, uh, learn the different missions and all of that good stuff, but two-shotting those battleships was quite a rush, a crazy, crazy experience. So there you go, guys. That was a quick damsel in distress. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, I'll see you next time.